Hi, I'm Tim. Welcome to our channel and thanks for logging on. Today we're discussing the Brigade Type 21 Reference 3810ST. You can see this 42mm flyback aviator's chronograph on our website. Purchase it there and if you enjoy these videos, please subscribe to our YouTube channel. You can also click on the card in the upper right hand corner of the screen at any time to see our full listing for this watch with additional accessories included, high resolution images and naturally complete pricing details. Now on my wrist, 6 and a third inches, 16 centimeters in circumference, you're looking at a watch that quite literally debuted for the 50th anniversary of the original military contract Brigade Type 20. Now the Type 20 was actually commissioned by the French Armed Forces in 1954. The watch named after the contract number, not so much the name of a watch as several manufacturers built them in the beginning, it nevertheless became inextricably linked to manufacture Brigade and in time it became the sporting flagship of what changed into a modern luxury watch manufacturer during the 90s and the 2000s. Now this watch part of a model line that debuted in 2004 was bigger than the original 1990s resurrection of the Breguet Type 20. Those watches were 39 millimeters. The Type 3810ST Type 20 is actually a 42 millimeter watch that you can see on my 6 and a third inch 16 centimeter wrist. Now the watch is also fairly thick, not excessively. It is 15.5 millimeters thick, but it does have a fighting chance against a dress cuff or a tight sleeve thanks to a generously sloped conical bi-directional bezel and a domed sapphire. From lug to lug, the watch is large but not overbearing, 49 millimeters from extremity to extremity. The real challenge in wearing this watch on a smaller wrist is the sheer substance of the strap, which is monstrously bolstered. Now that's handsome, and with conforming end profiles, it does look very integrated on the wrist, but because the strap's a little bit rigid, it will fight the curvature of a smaller wrist, and I would say that my wrist, approximately 16 centimeters in circumference, is probably the lower limit for wearing this watch without a fight without changing the strap. Now the case itself is wonderfully light on the wrist with beautifully curved lugs. It actually features many of the trademark elements of the Breguet manufacturer. You can see the highlight being the cold rolled coined case flanks. These are actually done by effectively forging the case, rolling it and then finishing it by hand to create that pattern. It's not simply etched out on a CNC. While the strap is immensely stiff, it's also built like a tank with quality to match. Very impressive with rectangular scale alligator leather. If you can't see the color to good effect in my light box, know that it is a dark brown with a contrasting white stitch. I can see it looks a little bit off-white on the electronic viewfinder of my camera. Now it's matched with a beautiful single fold deployment clasp, Brigade branded, for simplicity. This is very secure so that when you take the watch off, you don't have to worry about a conventional pin buckle popping open and causing you to drop the watch. So security is built in thanks to the buckle. The dial itself makes effective use of textures, planes, and grayscale. I should note that the bezel is bi-directional rotating in the tradition of aviation. This not being a dive watch, but 100 meter water resistant, you can, when you're on the surface, simply align the index, which is luminescent, with the minute hand and time a second simultaneous event while you time the first with the chronograph itself. Now I'll add that when I say that the dial makes effective use of grayscale, I mean everything from the white of the luminescent elements and the date disc to the almost black gradient of the 24 hour scale is effectively, should I say, differentiated. It doesn't have a sense of monotone that can sometimes afflict watches that use the white to black grayscale. This one's deftly designed. It also features high quality elements. As you can see, polished diamond style indices, fully loomed, it's visible in low or no light. And from the 60 minute rehaut down to the center dial, there's an effective use of changes of plane to add depth to the dial. And it does have a very subtle brushed texture that runs circumferentially around the periphery of the dial itself. So it's surprisingly nuanced for a watch that has utilitarian origins, but we remember Breguet in the modern era is a luxury watch manufacturer, getting back to its roots. Now the watch does feature a flyback chronograph. It's known as the Caliber 584, and it is based on the 
great tried and true Lamagna 1340 caliber. And I say great because that was one of the great chronograph designs of the 1970s. It featured on many pilots oriented Omega watches during the 1970s and many premium chronographs since. It's considered to be a step up and a significant one in terms of quality and engineering from something like a Valjoux 7750. And in this case, it features a quick set, a 24 hour AM PM indicator to distinguish the time at center, as well as the flyback function itself and radial seconds and minutes, which means that you can read the chronograph seconds and minutes off the center of the dial. There's the seconds hand, and then just behind it, I'll try to show in the angle, there is a diamond-tipped minutes hand that actually runs radially, so that rather than trying to read subdials with the exception of hours, you can simply read the two most important registers of the chronograph as you would read center hours and minutes. Now, I'll show you the case back, but there's not a whole lot going on back there. It's handsome, it's covered, it is screwed down, and it advertises the watch as reference 3810 automatic and 100 meter water resistant. So again, if this meaty strap doesn't quite float your boat, but you love the watch itself, put it on a NATO. It's absolutely true to the watch's aviation heritage. Plus, with the textile strap, you'll be able to avail yourself of the screw down crown and the impressive water resistance this summer. See it and buy it on our website.